Thank you. Well, tomorrow is the 4th of July and fireworks stands are having a busy weekend across Southeast Louisiana. But this Independence Day is coming with some unique challenges. Photojournalist Will Cespedes has more. They come in the sky every 4th of July and we can see them every 4th of July. Well, hopefully today it'll pick up. It's been a little slow the last couple of days. The weather, you know, has put a damper on us. But uh, hopefully today the weather will hold out and we'll better pick up some sales today. More often than not, they come late night on the 4th and they have to scavenge whatever they could find that we have left. The supply chain is, is extremely difficult this year. Uh, we're having really no problems getting the bigger stuff. The smaller stuff is, you know, the tanks, the smoke balls, the, the, the little things that seem on the 4th of July that's popular is, is very hard to get. Without the, the, the normal supply, it is very hard to satisfy the customer. A lot of the customers are return customers and they come back looking for certain things that they really like and we weren't able to get them this year. Let's do, uh... To me, you know, 4th of July is probably the most important one of all. We, we, you know, we're celebrating our independence and for the men and women of the military, you know, this is an honor of them. That was photojournalist Will Cespedes. New Orleans' Go Forth on the River fireworks display will be temporarily shutting down the Algiers Ferry tomorrow night. Service between the Algiers Point and Canal Street route will be suspended from 8.30 to 9.30 p.m. as the Coast Guard closes down the river. Ferry service will continue when the river reopens. A shuttle bus will be offered at the terminals in the meantime.